Welcome back to another Tech Thursday. Want to thank everyone for tuning in today. We're going to be taking a look at some keycaps that I got around for the $20 range. The set I have right here is a 61 key layout that can be distinguished in four colors. We got red, white, blue, and gray. The key set is OEM profile with the material being made out of PBT. This provides it higher quality and more durability, allowing it to withstand most defects that come into play such as oils from your fingers, stains, and even shining. I have two keyboards that we're going to apply these keycaps to. One model is white and the other one is going to be black. Then we'll do some final customizations at the end. If you're only here for the keycaps, I'll place a timestamp in the comment section which you can use to skip ahead. All the products used in this video will be included in the description and if you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment down below. We're going to first install these keycaps to the black keyboard which is a Geek GK61. Let's take our keycap remover. Took off all the keycaps and now we're going to apply this key set to the layout. These are going to be attached to Gateron Browns. These are optical switches and the PCB is hot swappable. So that means I could just pull the, I could just pull the switch right off easily and then just put it back on. And since I already have everything formatted, it's just as easy as just taking one and then putting it on top. So I'm going to try to push this a little bit further so you can see what I'm working on. Nice. So I'm just gonna slightly push it in one at a time. I'm not going to force it in just yet, but it looks pretty nice so far. I like that it's in four different colors. We got red, white, blue, and, and gray. The only thing I hate about forcing a keycap in is that it makes it more difficult to pull out. I just hate having to use force to remove a keycap. But if I don't push it all the way in, then you can see like some are sticking out like this three right here. If I just push it in a little, now it, it's like all aligned. Honestly, all these keyboard terms are really difficult to learn. I just got into keyboards not too long ago and you know, I still don't know too much about them and I'm learning as I go. And thankfully I have people in my comment section that are teaching me all these terminologies. So it's nice. I got people looking out for me. Instead of caps lock, you get this thing called hyper. Instead of um, windows, you get super or something. So I'm just using whatever it looks like. Where's the rest? One second, I'm getting a call here. What's up? What do you mean what's up? I'm in the middle of a recording right now, actually. Oh, sorry. Okay. I'm Are you getting, getting ready for school? Ready. Oh, yeah. Do you want to see what I'm working on? Mm -hmm. Actually, let me make it. Let me make it full. Wow. Screen. What? <laughs> what? No, I said I'm gonna put. Okay, <laughs> earlier in the video, I said I'm gonna put these keycaps on a black keyboard and a white keyboard. Okay. Uh, no one's okay. trying to flex here. Yeah. No one's. You want yeah. me to? No, I'm just yeah. kidding. <laughs> oh, guess what? Guess what? Guess what shirt I'm wearing? Wa -fa! Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> All right. What do you think? I'll I'll let you be the first Damn. person to give me an impression about how these keycaps look like. You can see the difference <laughs> between one keyboard that's just, you know, factory color, all one white. You have some keys that are gray. You have some keys that are blue, white, and red. How does it sound? Sounds pretty nice. I believe the space bar is 6.25U, so it's not going to fit most builds like Razer and Corsair keyboards. So you just gotta oh. make sure. I think, yeah, it's the same size as yeah. the, the N Pro. So I don't oh, have any. It? Actually, I do have a Razer keyboard, but I don't know where I. Put... Oh, it's... No, I'm not even gonna bother getting it. It's like packed away. But yeah, <laughs> I like it. Look at that. Let's see it from the side. All right. So these are OEM profiles, okay? So it's a little bit yeah. taller in structure. You can mm. see it from like right there. If I take like, I don't think I have any cherry keycaps, so you can see the difference. Because oh. most of these are OEM. Yeah, these yeah, are all OEMs. Mm -hmm. If it was um cherry, a cherry profile, then it'll be like cut off like probably a few millimeters less in oh. terms of the the height. Oh wow! Pretty cool, dude. <laughs> Focus. Oh man. Sexy. Okay, so. Oh. I'm gonna take some other keycaps real quick and add on to this. All right, let's take this off and put, is this the right one? Huh, it's a, this way or this oh, the other way? 
So I broke one of the stabilizers on my um on this keyboard right here because um, uh, I did I did maybe. a test right. I did a physical test and I did a water test on it where I dropped. Okay, first I dropped this keyboard to see if it <laughs> if it would still work. Why would you do such <laughs> And then oh, we did a water a water test where we submerged it in water to see if it will still work and it survived mm -hmm. both of them. The keyboard survived, but the, sta yeah, the stabilizers didn't. like broke off. So the right oh, side <laughs> is not holding up the keycap. So if I press down on the left side, right, you can see it yeah. right here. Ah. Uh... Okay. Do you think it looks nice on black, or do you think it'll look better on the white? I wish it had a low profile. Uh, mm -hmm. what do you call it? A housing. So you see this? Um, yeah, you see the the case, right? Mm. If it was like half the size of this. I think that would look really nice. A lot of poker boards by Vortex Gear mm. have low profile housings. So you can see like mm. basically the keycaps and the switches. Um, another example, oh. you know my um, my keypad, wherever it is. Yeah. You see how it has like a low profile right here? So you can see, you can see switches. the, yeah, this, you can see the switches and the keycaps. So for oh. example, if I were to put them side by side, they'll be like half. Oh. Like, not half the size, but like two thirds of it in Germany. Oh, look what I have right here. Oh, boys, we're eating good tonight. You know what this is? Oh, what is this? Wendy's or it's not Wendy's? It's. I, I don't know if you ever had Coney Island before. Mm -mm. Oh, look at Ushi. Ushi's already here. Ushi's like, oh my god, please. <laughs> please. Watch. Ushi, come here. Look at her. She's like, oh, please. <laughs> please, can I just have it? Hi, baby. So, if you never had Coney Islands before, basically it's just hot dogs with like chili. And onions and like stuff on top of it. <laughs> Just trying to lick it. <laughs> it's pretty She's good. Like, I feel hungry. All right. I don't want to take it out because I don't want to dirty my hands. Because I could already get some oil on my fingers already. And working on keyboards is no bueno. Sponsor, hold on, hold, hold on, hold on. I'm gonna show you guys the coolest sponsor in the world. <laughs> Sponsored. Oh my god, it's so stupid. I can't believe you bought that. It's not even good. Even Quiet. Also. All right. What do you use to wash your hands then? You what? You go to the bathroom like a normie and clean your hand in the sink? I go to the bathroom and wash my hands with soap. No, you you get dude wipes, <laughs> which are the number one <laughs> leading wipes in the world that not only clean your hands, but disinfects them, all the bacteria, <laughs> the pathogens, <laughs> any other big word that I don't know about. They're hypoallergenic. <laughs> Paraben free. You know what that means? Do what you know that what that mean? means? I don't even know what that means, but that's a big word. <laughs> so that must mean something. And it comes to 48 wipes, not 49, not, even not 47, 48 wipes. All right. All right, boys. Um, I forgot to transition, but we're going to install the keycaps to the Anpro 2. This is the white edition. Comes with kale box switches. Probably one of my favorite switches so far. I think I'm getting some jade switches pretty soon. They're really expensive. You know how much they cost? Mm -mm. They're like six dollars for a pack of ten. Probably more because they're out of stock everywhere. I I checked novel keys. I checked uh, KBD fans. Yo, eBay has them for like eight dollars for a pack of ten. I don't even think I don't even think Banggood has any available either. So I need seventy because you know they come in a pack of ten. And since these keyboards are 61, you know, not 60, you have to buy an extra 10. Oh, for everybody that's asking, because I've been getting a lot of uh, comments, right? They're like, yo, Ace, that table is so nice, dude. How much did you pay for that? That looks so expensive. It's a TV tray dinner <laughs> table. <laughs> if I zoom out, right? If I, if I zoom out, you can see like right here. It's literally so small. I was going to go to Ikea <laughs> to purchase a really expensive uh, table, but it was like, I think $200 for, it's called the rustic gray, which is uh, the type of wood. I scratch a piece of it because I was taking apart the legs the other day, because I was gonna put this on my <laughs> table. Yo, I scratched the surface so bad and I'm trying to hide it so people don't see it. It's like, uh, hold on, maybe you guys can see it. It's somewhere here. Oh, it's right here. If I move this plant out of the way, you can see the scratch. See, that's why you put the plant there. Yeah, that's why I put the plant there. Behind the scene, boys. <laughs> Even though this is in the actual video. Yo, these keycaps are pretty cool, not gonna lie. How much do you think these keycaps cost? Um... Four. Four dollars? Yes. 
four dollars for the whole thing. No, of course not. Okay. For like... No, you no a, a key set comes in the whole thing. So how much do you think uh, the whole thing costs? Ten. Ten dollars. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Well, I'm just I'm just basing off what you think, you know, yeah, since you don't know anything about keyboards. Exactly. I know that's that's the best part because I want you to see, I want your estimate on something that you think based on okay, the appearance. 20. So it's twenty dollars. Yes. Twenty dollars for these keycaps. Okay, when you say it like that, it makes me, <laughs> it makes me feel well. Like no, I'm wrong. I'm not I'm not saying you're right <laughs> and I'm not saying you're wrong. I'm just saying. 25. And can you? All right. So can you give me a reason why you think it's twenty five dollars? When it comes to keycaps, um, you have to consider what it takes to make it. You know, what is made out of the material, the printing. To be honest, I wouldn't think it'd be that much for this for this particular one. I'm saying. God damn it! You made me drop a key. What? Why are you blaming me? Oh, the oh. <laughs> you know what? When I hear a dumb joke, my friend told this to me a long time ago. Okay, so he was like. Because I used to um, text my friends when I'm working, right? Because mm -hmm. it helps pass by time. Um, this one time, I was talking to one of my boys, and he was like, yo, I lost control at work today. And I was like, yo, what the hell? What happened? And then he sends me this picture, right? He sends me this picture. Do you know what it was? What was it? He said, I lost control at work today. Oh <laughs> my like, yo, god, I, lost control. I know I was what like, you're trying to show me. The god damn it, because that was the first time I heard about that <laughs> dumb joke, right? <laughs> <laughs> you guys want to know something? I bought this um ten dollar vacuum cleaner for your keyboard, right? Cause Ooh. a lot of people tend to use those air compressors. I think that's what it's called. Mm -hmm. You know those con mm -hmm. compressed mm -hmm. air cans. Yeah, in the that, can. Yeah, yeah, it costs like three dollars per can, mm -hmm. right? And mm -hmm. bro, by the time I spray it once, it's it's already all gone. It doesn't work anymore. <laughs> so I, I resort to doing this. <laughs> Cause there's like Jesus. hair everywhere in my keyboard and dust. But I have this $10 vacuum that's coming in, I don't know, probably next month or something. Mm. And I want to test it out to see if it can really clean out your keyboard. I don't think it's going to mm. do that big of a difference, but it'll do enough to like, you know, remove the dust and the hair. Not, yeah. It's not going to clean like, you know, any like stains or as long as it could remove the dust, you know, if I'm eating Doritos on top of my keyboard and stuff like that, that's more than enough. Yeah. <laughs> Let's do one more look at this keyboard. This is on the black model. Should I do a quick typing test? The fingers are so long. <laughs> you know what to say about long fingers. <laughs> Let's attach it to the white one. All right, boys, white or black? <laughs> oh, I don't want to take it off. I wish I had two sets of these, man. You know how much more convenient that would be? No. Yeah. Imagine having two sets. Imagine having more than one keyboard. Well, I'm talking about being efficient. You really want me to sit here for 20 <laughs> minutes trying to take apart one key set to attach it to another keyboard when I could just have two already? Wow, imagine having two. Yeah. Why not? <laughs> See, this is what I'm talking about, boys. When you force your keycaps into the switches, and since this is hot swappable, look, <laughs> you end up pulling Comes the switch out. <laughs> out. <laughs> oh, That's why I don't want to force it in there. But don't worry. And Pro 2, the switches are soldered into the PCB. Can you guess what song I'm listening to right now? You think I listen to the same BTS song over and over or something? Because yes. I do. <laughs> You need to get your nails done. Okay, so you want me to like color my nails every time or something? <laughs> yeah. Yo, people don't know this, but my nails grow back so quickly. I l cut my nails at least once a week, right? Probably twice a week. But dude, I cut my nails. Okay, Monday, right? It's Wednesday right now, boys. It's Wednesday, my dudes. Look at my nails. Hold on, let me. Bro, I literally cut them on Monday. Why are they growing Imagine. so quickly? You know, I don't even know if I put these keys correctly. <laughs> oh god. Alright, so what I was doing at the beginning of the video was I had all the keys laid out and I was playing um, crossword puzzles, whatever, jigsaw puzzles by myself, trying to put the layout of the keys. Like, you see, like, stuff like this, right? I'm trying to, like, put them all together, like, one by one, and, like, see if I can remember it. 
from memory. Shit, I knew I put it backwards. U and Y are backwards. Oh, sh- Yo. Someone's car is getting stolen, boys. It's over. <laughs> it's all over now. Yo, this morning I woke up to, like, my neighbors arguing, and it was so funny. Why? What was that arguing about? I don't know. I think, like, homeboy was, like, cheating on her or something. <gasps> and and she's like, you should just go back to your own trashy life. And he's like, ah, my life is already trashy because I'm with you or something. Oh, damn. Yo, they were, like, fighting, dude. It was, like, Street Fighter. Legit Street Fighter <laughs> because they're on the streets yelling at each other and fighting. Oh, come on. These are backwards, too. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, just just you wait. You're gonna see in my comments. <laughs> He's like, lol, look at this Pepega putting all the keys backwards. <laughs> Are you missing a keycap or? What do you mean I'm missing a keycap? For the third row. Oh, no, never mind. <laughs> you were holding on to it. No, Yo, one lost. of my biggest fears of using my nails to take this out is what if I, like, <laughs> what if my nail comes <laughs> <What>? off? <laughs> What? No. Like the whole nail just falls off. No, honey, it takes a lot. That's terrifying. Yeah. It could happen. You never mm -hmm. know. It could happen. I can guarantee you it will not. All right, how does this look? My stabilizers are working perfectly because it's not broken like the other one. Oh, look at it. It's so nice. Bluetooth too. Oh, if I oh. turn this on, you can see the RGB. <gasps> wow. wow. Oh, but my wire is like 200 feet away and I don't want to get it. <laughs> now that is what I'm talking about right there. <laughs> What's the super key? Hmm? <laughs> Nine. So how much would you pay for these keycaps right here? 20. 20 dollars. Less than that. 15. 15? 15. 15? Mm -hmm. Do you know how much? I would not spend that much. You wouldn't spend that much on keycaps. Mhm. Mm so if you see a keycap set. On these keycaps. On okay. these ones, specifically. Cause you're talking all that smack, bro. I'm not. I'm just giving you my opinion. Oh, ho, 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 ho. isn't that so? The sick one. <laughs> the sick one. Sicker. Sickle mode. All right, let's put this in shot. So how much would you pay for these keycaps then? I would pay... 25. 25 for these keycaps right here. Mm. Okay. <laughs> Baby, this is literally a beacon in your room. <laughs> a, trying to do that bat symbol. <laughs> We'll just keep it rainbow, cause you know everybody's part of the rainbow. You're either blue, you green, right. yellow, purple, pink. That was my stomach. <laughs> 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 I hungry. I just want to end this video so I can eat. You know what I should have done? I should have plugged in this keyboard when I had it installed and put on the lighting for it. Why didn't I think of that? Why didn't you guys tell me? I, I knew we should have done this live. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think that's everything we need to discuss about the video, right? Did you learn a lot mm -hmm. from this video? You don't even yes, know, you don't even know what I talked about. I didn't, I didn't even know what, <laughs> we didn't what, even what, talk what, about what the, the keycaps. Okay, these are OEM profile keycaps. They come in a 61 key set. So you get 61 keys in total. Red, white, gray, and this blue one right here. But I just switched it out because I think yellow looks better than blue. This, all these keycaps right here came with the Anpro too. So that's the only reason why I'm installing these. But these retail for $20. I think at the time of me recording, it's $17.99. I purchased these from Banggood. And yeah, as you can see for yourself, Pretty freaking sweet, if I don't say so myself. Or is it hey, if so I do I say was, so myself? I was hey, I was at the door. I was at 20. No, I said 17.99. Yeah. Plus shipping and handling. Well, Tommy's skin. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's everything we need to say. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you guys want to pick up these keycaps, I'll put a link in the description. If you want more keyboard videos, just let me know. We could either do this live, we could do this recorded, we could talk about anything you want. There was some stuff I needed to say, but I got distracted because my girlfriend came on and 
I didn't get to talk about what I wanted to talk about today. So, yeah. Maybe Bye. in the next video. Hi, Ushi. My dog's here. She's like, oh, please. Can I eat the hot dog now, please? <laughs> look at the Ushi. Here. Yeah. Look at her. Look at her. Ushi. Hi. Ushi, don't eat the keyboard. <laughs> <laughs> My little Ushi. Look at her. She's like, please. Oh, she's so cute. <laughs> please, I just want to eat the hot dog. <laughs> please. <laughs> she's so cute. Look at her. Mwah.